Innovation and adaptive leadership is embedded into who we are at RCA Global Mission. As you might imagine, mission particularly is innovative and you have, it demands that you be adaptive. Today, I'd like to introduce you to my hero of the faith, one of the RCA's own mission legends, a woman named Ida Scudder. Now, Ida Scudder is the picture-perfect example of someone who adapted in following her call to follow Jesus Christ in mission. She saw a need, and she innovated to find a solution, one that would go on to change the entire community that she set out to serve, and in the process, changed a nation. I want to tell you that story, but you know what's even better? I'm going to have Ida tell you her story. One evening, I was sitting alone in my room, reading when I heard steps on the veranda, and soon a knock. I went to the door and saw a Brahmin gentleman. I asked him if I could do anything for him. Oh, yes, Amma, he said, I so need your help. My wife is dying in childbirth, and Amma, she is such a lovely girl. I heard that you would come to India and I thought you could help us. But I replied, I know nothing about childbirth, but my father is a doctor and I can bring him. He can save your little wife. Almost in horror, he raised his hands, saying, I could not take a man into my house. No man can look upon my wife. If you cannot come, she must die. He left and I sat down at my desk, feeling desperate. After some time, I heard footsteps. I ran to the door, thinking that the Brahmin had returned. Instead, there stood a Mohammedan, and with the same request, he too turned away, repeating the same words, Oh, she must die. I felt I could not bear it. And again, I heard footsteps in the same evening. Similar requests came from a third man. There was no sleep for me that night. I could not forget those three young women dying in childbirth when I could not help them. By morning, my decision was made. I could go to America, study medicine, and return to India as a doctor to try to save the lives of those who needed me. Wasn't that an amazing story? Ida's story is an inspiration for all of us to be adaptive in our call as we follow Christ in mission. Because following God, as you well know, isn't always a straight path. And it often involves morphing and adapting and changing to what the people we meet along the way need and how God decides to use us wherever we find ourselves. So as you hear Ida's story, the question I would love for you to be reflecting on with me is, in your own ministry context, how are you seeing adaptive leadership and innovation taking shape?